The first day of school is tomorrow for many Eastern Iowa students. And Marion Police Officer and Linmar SRO Tom Dobbs joins us now. Thank you for being here, Tom. Thank you, ladies. And as school begins tomorrow, people are going to be back on the roads along with school buses. What are some things that drivers can keep in mind? Yes, tomorrow is the first day of school, and as a school resource officer, I'll be honest, it's kind of magical to see everybody coming back to school, whether it's kindergartners for their first first day or some of the seniors, it's their, their last first day. So it's just a neat day. But with all of those kids coming back to school, we just want everyone to be safe. So you see that big yellow school bus and that piece you showed earlier, it's like, how do you not see that bus with the flashing lights? Please stop when you see the stop arm out. Otherwise, it's a $330 ticket and a lot of local buses have those cameras on it. And if you go past the stop school bus, that's not gonna be a good day. And they're very dangerous to kids also when you're driving around there. And it's also a very hot first day. What are some things parents should keep in mind when kids are walking to school or riding the bus? Exactly. And this is my 12th year being a school resource officer, and I've never seen the start of school this warm. Now, granted, Iowa does get a little hot at times, but just with the weather warnings that we're seeing, just be mindful, have that hydration, extra water. Uh, if you're taking your kids to school or dropping your kids off at daycare, whatever the case may be, when you get to your final destination, always check in the back seat. Maybe leave your briefcase or purse, your phone in the back seat so you're reminded to check that back seat before you get out of the car. Just it's a situation whether it's pets or, or, or small humans in the car, make sure that everybody's out of the car when you turn the car off. Yeah, that's a really good point, and it is going to be so hot. I know, Linmar, where your SRO, they're letting out early, and people are going to be starting new routines, possibly, with the first day of school. So what are some things to keep in mind with the heat, especially, I know you mentioned checking the back of the car. Is there anything else people should keep in mind? Just be mindful that it is going to be warm. If you have access to air conditioning, great. Stay in and stay cool. Otherwise, a fan or whatever you have to keep yourself cool and those around you. If you have an um, uh, elderly neighbor, just kind of check in on them. Make sure their air conditioning is working. Again, the, that heat's going to sneak up on people, and it could be um, a, quite a traumatic event for someone dealing with loss of air conditioning or not having a fan or some kind of cooling station. Just be mindful that we want to get through this, each and every one of us, and it's going to be kind of, kind of warm and unbearable, but there are ways to beat the heat, and we just want people to exercise those avenues. Important to be patient, too, in the heat. It can be kind of stressful and make you hot and angry. But also when there's extra traffic on the road, if you're route to work, all of a sudden there's a school bus there. Exactly, and just patience. There's going to be kids walking to school, riding bikes, parents dropping off, and the buses are going to be back on it. Just give yourself a little extra time in the morning. And like you said, Jackie, patience, patience is a virtue. Just slow down, give yourself that extra time. There's going to be a lot more kids out on the sidewalks and roads and intersections, crosswalks. Just be mindful of that and be safe, be responsible. Have a good first day of school everybody for yeah. everybody yes <laughs> all right officer Dobbs thanks for joining us here today thank you and now here's your GMA first look